view from our table at Sapori Italian here at Harris Lake Tahoe. Look at the mountains and the lake. Beautiful. Really beautiful. What a scenic place to have dinner. Don't you agree? Oh, absolutely. And that is some type of olive oil. That looks like kind of olive thing. oil. And of course, they brought us the bread basket. No. Which I'll try to avoid, but no promises. Oh, vacation, no, vacation. Uh, not warm. Okay, but not, well, but you know assorted. what? Assorted. There's a special thing they told me on the menu that you have to try here, and it's a special bread stuffed with cheese and served with a fig marmalade. So. But that's on the menu. On the menu, we might have okay. to get that just to try, but beautiful. Just beautiful. And you, lots to choose from and lots of specialty cocktails. Yeah. That's the appetizers, salad soups. They even have pizza here. I'm kind of in a pizza mood. Of course, the pasta course, the uh, meat and seafood, fish section, and sides. We're going to look at the menu and hopefully find yeah, delicious food to show you. see what we want. We'll go back. Perfect. That's beautiful. Now, what is this? Is the Prince of Pesa. And I know there's peach in there and... Uh, oh, no, that's the peach bellini. Oh, that's the oh. other one. This one's... Oh, peach schnapps oh, is okay, in here. Oh, peach schnapps in this Yes. One. Yep. It's cranberry orange juice in a Thank Prosecco you. float. I guess that's floating. Sweet. That looks awesome. <laughs> Have you made some decisions on the menu? Yes, we have. We have. Gave Dwayne the special blue See, stuffed. Out. They're nice and stuffed. Those are queens. These are queens, big ones, yeah. Go ahead. Nice, lots of blue cheese. They've been Ooh. soaked in my vodka. So to me, what ruins an olive is when it's too salty. Is that one salty? These are almost hint of salt. Really, not salty Very at all. Very nice and smooth. And then it comes, you get a little, I think, from the off the blue cheese as well. Right. Really balanced. So that's, it's a a, great, that's a good olive. Oh. oh, yeah. You can order one of those again. I, I, you <laughs> and I will. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Mm -hmm. And your? Let's have you. Oh, i got to eat this olive first. Let me just get this yeah, glass out of it. Thank you. Thank you. I'll stick to the vodka. Thank you. I'll try this. <laughs> I've never had this Principessa, so. Principessa. Made with peach schnapps and a few other flavors. Orange, cranberry, Orange, cranberry. and vodka. It I think it's actually Tito's. Oh, I don't know. It looks beautiful, and I love how we poured it. Lightly sweet. Yeah. Yeah, because they just started with the vodka and the little peel there, which has a name. Yeah. Excellent. That's great. Perfect. Very nice. Off to a great start. Oh, and this was interesting, right? You weren't sure about yeah, that. Yeah, that's a EVO for the bread or oil for the bread that they brought. Oh. I'm trying to avoid bread anyway, and of course, I'm not going to have bread and a slice or two of pizza. And pizza, and a, yeah. So just uh, we should just mention what we ordered. We did. We are trying their meatball appetizer made of mm -hmm. beef and pork. We are also trying, which is supposedly one of the best people have had their yes, Caesar, Caesar salad. And yeah, I'm getting wanna... the flatbread with the spicy, well, I think it's a has pizza. a spice, yeah, it's a pizza, but it's really a flatbread, yeah, but it's, it's a, it's really a pepperoni pizza. Right, but it's but a spicy it is. It's one of their pepperoni flat, called uh, a Diavolo. Diavolo. And I'm getting their special, was it a ravioli with lobster? Stuffed with lobster and, and served with lobster. And served with, like, it said four ounces of lobster tail, yeah. and it does come with a little bit of a truffle oil topping, but we, we passed on that. Absolutely passed so, on it. Yep. We will see things in a minute. Yep. Okay, so she Here, is about to try this meatball and cut into it. Oh, nice and soft. And it's, what's that cheese? It's not it's a ricotta. mozzarella. It's a, it's ricotta. a ricotta. Oh, okay. And a nice toasted. Oh, but that's some garlic bread. Is that toasted garlic bread? Um, that's what it looks like. It looks like it. It's at least buttery with something. It has a lot of sauce that I want to taste, too. All right. And I'm going to hunk off a piece of, oh, it's buttery and garlicky. I can feel it. Yeah. That's my I'm gonna fork. I'm going to try to change my angle a bit here because of the light coming through. Let me try it out. Let's see what you think. Really homemade yeah, tasting meatball. Yeah. Mix of beef and pork. More beef than pork, though. Um, really a homemade more beefy, tasting. Yeah. Very homemade tasting. How's um, that? The sauce. Not a lot of breadcrumbs or filler. It's mostly meat. Oh. 
The sauce is. Let me try this extra. I am. I'm gonna help I like, you with that sauce I like too. the cheese, cream ricotta. It's a very good meatball. It tastes. I haven't had like um meatball in a long time that was made with a lot of meat and not a lot of the breadcrumb filler kind of stuff. It's not as smooth as a meatball that has all that filler, nope. but it's more meaty and tastes, you know, really good. Uh, it looks nice and light, like you chop through it really easily. Oh no, it's very, very moist it's not and delicious, a dense, it's, but you'll see, it's I'm a very meaty a mushroom. Uh, uh, meatball. Very meaty meatball. <laughs> okay. I like it. All right, well, let me try it out. I'm just taking this right since it was in the sauce. I'm just going to. You can go ahead and have that. Take I'm not going to have bite. Any more. No, no, but I want to take a bite of the sauce since it was already. The wet. sauce is awesome. If I have a criticism about this, it could be hotter. That's the only one. What? It's yummy. It's a very nice sauce. Oh, the sauce is delicious. Nice spice level. <laughs> A little bit of a, a zing, not so much a sweet. Like this doesn't really come through as a strong has, sweet flavor at all. But it has really yummy. But the sauce. Mm. Oh, wait till you taste that meatball. It's really good. Cut. The more I'm eating my meatball, the more, <laughs> the more I you're love enjoying my it. Yeah. yeah. Make sure I get a little extra sauce to go over it, and the excess can go right there. <laughs> yeah, you can actually put the meatball. I probably just dunk that in. Go ahead. Right. There use we it go. All up. Oh, we're gonna use it. It's really yummy. What do you think? And that garlic bread. It's good. Really nice. Yeah. Crispy, buttery. Here goes the meatball taste. A nice compliment for the meatballs. Yeah. You think it was more beefy, huh? You don't think it's I think that it was more beefy. balanced. I think it's pretty good. No, even. you can taste the pork in it, but it's more beefy than porky, I think. It's it's more firm. When you make a meatball with more pork than beef, it's softer. I do like the ricotta in in the sauce the cream yeah that makes that it that creamy little note going on there yeah makes it very nice very like very it. good very satisfying really yummy yep until the next course it's been reported as this is this it. is this is the if you're gonna have a caesar have this, this is one. a kind of caesar i will warn you the croutons said anchovy in them so oh. they may be a very salty or be a little fishy but that's only the crouton okay you try so, it then. You and matter of fact just to verify it and you know this is split somebody would have been given this entire yeah, this salad half, and it's huge we, we each have. got half of one order but a good caesar is worth its weight in gold and that's what it looks like actually the crouton is not it's kind of nice I only took a small piece of crouton, though. Did you? You're going to have to try it. What do you think um, overall? It has that... Nice salad? It has chunks of fresh parmesan, so it's not grated over it. You know, it's sliced off the block. Um, a nice Italian, like a vinaigrette, light vinaigrette on there. Maybe a little creamy. Well, it's called Caesar dressing. <laughs> right. That's why they call it a Caesar salad. No, they call it a vinaigrette. Caesar it's, vinaigrette. Yes. It's very nice. It is. It's been reported as... This is this it. This is. This is the, if you're going to have a Caesar, have this, this one. This is a kind of Caesar. I will warn you. The croutons said anchovy in them. So oh. they may be A, very salty, or B, a little fishy. But that's only the crouton. Okay. You try so, it then. You and matter of first. fact, just to verify it. And you know, this is split. Somebody would have been given this entire yeah, this salad, half, and it's huge. We, we each have. got half of one order. But a good Caesar is worth its weight in gold. And? That's what it looks like. Actually, the crouton is not. It's kind of nice. I only took a small piece of crouton, though. Did You're you? going to have to try it. What do you think um, overall? It has that. Nice salad? It has chunks of fresh parmesan, so it's not grated over it. You know, it's sliced off the block. Um, a nice Italian, like a vinaigrette, light vinaigrette on there. Maybe a little creamy. Well, it's called Caesar dressing. <laughs> right. That's why they call it a Caesar salad. No, they call it a vinaigrette. Caesar it's, vinaigrette. Yes. It's very nice. It is. Mm -hmm. It's the lightest Caesar salad dressing I think I've ever had. Very it's, light. it's like a vinaigrette. Very, very, very light for Caesar salad dressing. Mm -hmm. Big, delicious pieces 
of cheese that were shaved off the block. Yeah, I love the cheese. The crouton is savory. Right, the crouton's really good. For something that's supposed to have anchovy in it, if there's anchovy, it's pretty subtle. Very good, nice and light. And I'm gonna show you something on my plate. I'm not quite sure what it is. As I come down close, see those little fig colored, like little jam? I don't know if they are. I think it's anchovy stuff. If they paste, are maybe. eggs, anchovy eggs, I have no idea. Anchovy Those, paste? No, it's not a paste. They look. Okay, we'll get nice and close. Looks a lot like a little egg. Oh, there's some good ones over there. I'm gonna try to find out what that what that is. I'll probably just have to ask. Mm, they but land it on is the bottom a, of the plate. But it is a very nice Caesar. So, very light, well, light, refreshing. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're gonna enjoy these. Trying your pizza, or do you want to see me start? First? Let's see you. This is. Want to see what's in my? This is the lobster stuffed ravioli with a lobster tail yeah, and lobster meat. That's... Special. Show me what the inside. Is uh, it really lobster? It's lobster color. Oh. And it's got a very nice little sauce down here, and I think it needs a little bit more cheese on top. Of course, everything needs more cheese. A little more cheese. The world needs How's more cheese. How's that looking? Cheese. Do I have, oh, awesome. I need to get a little better stab at it. Ah, there we go. Got wow. a little more cheese. Let me try it. This looks great. That lobster comes through a lot. So I didn't expect that much lobster flavor. Wow. And the pasta's perfect. I mean, it's, it's I'm all not fresh surprised. Made. It's all fresh made lobster stuffed here on site. And, and they're fresh parmesan on top. Uh, what did I get? And it looks like kale. No? Mm, no, baby spinach maybe? Maybe. Yep. Very good. And little tiny... Uh, I'm not sure if it's onion. Scallion. It's it said scallion. 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 Yes, green onion. Oh, Just very a good. little bit. A nice little hint of it. This is awesome. I'm eating it all. Okay, I, I, <laughs> and I'm going to try a bite of this now. This is the yeah. Diavolo. Diavola? Diavolo with pizza a very spicy, with a little extra. Spicy uh, pepperoni. Wait. I'm going to go with a little piece. Uh oh, he's going to try a piece first. And I'm first. not even going to wait see. for her. Yeah. Go ahead. Because I'm really trying to save myself for this meal. This is great. Just go ahead. Mm. Mm. It is spicy. I love spicy. And the sauce is uh, tangy. Okay. A very tangy That's sauce. That's going to work for me. Nice cheese. Uh, I'll show you a little bit of your, the crust you Crusty, like to see. fresh, crisp, uh. thin crust bottom. Yeah, you're going to enjoy that a lot. I can't wait to try it. You're about to. Mm -hmm. Yep. Hi, so. Diablo. Mm. Wow. Um, there's a place in Providence that serves a Diablo pizza. Diablo pizza uses a very spicy version of a pepperoni, and this is spicy but heavenly. And how about that sauce? Does it have like a oh. nice tanginess to it? Oh. It's a San Marzano tomato sauce, garlicky, fresh, fresh mozzarella. Fresh mozzarella, yeah. And look at the, it's not that cheesy, cheesy, it's not that, it's not those pepperoni circles that you buy in the supermarket. This is, look at the shape. It comes in a thing that they slice themselves. It's amazing, in a flatbread, the only thing I would say, if this were crispier, you'd go a little more char on the knee. A little more char, a little more crispy. But That's I will say, wonderful. This is like a nine out of ten from the yeah, flatbread it, it pizza, like, thin crust pizza category. Absolutely, very, very it's good. excellent. All about the toppings. Yep. Wow, is this is the bar. <laughs> I <laughs> thought you were done over there, huh? So beautiful. All right, everybody. So that was Sapori, Italian. Oh my God. It used to be a buffet, and thank God they replaced it with Sapori because, oh Very my God. Very high-end Italian. Yeah, this is five star. It is absolutely, and it was a three and a half, four star price. So well worth every penny, 
I mean, if we didn't have a beautiful reservation tomorrow night, we'd just come back here. I had the best ravioli, lost ravioli. Never had better. Just never. I was thinking about it, never. And they do, they puree lobster into the ravioli. It's, and the sauce, the cream sauce they use, no tomato anywhere. Beautiful. I love the, I love the scallions they added in it. And then your pizza. So, well, we brought the pizza with us back to the room. We're going to eat it cold. I mean, I had a slice, <laughs> maybe two. Yeah, and I tried it too. And it I'm is, so full, and I that am. That spicy, tangy, every. Ah, oh, it's got hits all the notes. So, so this is Sapori uh, in South Lake Tahoe at Harris on the Harris. 18th floor. As you can see behind us, yeah. beautiful view of Lake Tahoe and the mountains. Yeah, a little weather coming in, but still, it's beautiful. So, and uh, until next time, which won't be long, we will see you guys. Bye.